Hello, this is Ike from Spot Home London and today we are in southwest London. We are in the Morden area and we're only about a 12 minute walk away from the station and at the station we have the Northern Line. Now with that said, there are a number of cafes and restaurants right by the station so going out and getting a quick bite to eat is not going to be a problem. Uh, today we're going to be seeing the house and there are three bedrooms available and we're going to be seeing all of them. So let's go ahead and see his rooms. So here's the front street, it's a very calm and peaceful area as we are in the cul-de-sac so we just get the neighboring houses as well as the street so as we step into the home we get the stairs to the right the cat on top of the stairs there and then a radiator directly to our left so the first rooms are here on the left is going to be for the landlord as there is a living landlady. Further on is going to be the kitchen and then to the right we do have a downstairs toilet. So first we'll see that. Here is a toilet as well as a sink and glass shelf. There's also a small mirror above on the wall. So this room leads into the living room, which is all a part of the kitchen we'll see now. It's all an open floor plan area. So this is the kitchen, a spectacular kitchen. And we also have a number of appliances. So starting here down on the left, we do have the washing machine. We've got the sink up on the countertop. Dishwasher down below that. And on the other side of the countertops, we have the stove, oven, microwave, toaster above that, and then a dryer down below. So there's also plenty of drawers and storage for food, as well as plates or pots and pans. Also got a coffee maker, in case I missed that. So now the fridge and freezer we can see here on the right, it's impressively big. So the view of the kitchen from this side looks like this. And then to the right here we have the living room area, which is currently the private landlord's area and she's actually sitting there right now. So hello. Hi. <laughs> this is a lovely dining room area here and we can see the view of the garden outside of these windows. So the windows are in fact folding glass doors and the garden does go down quite a while. There's also a shed at the back too. There's the possibility of you having some storage space there. You just have to refer to the landlord. Now moving upstairs, we'll see the three bedrooms. So we've got the carpeted steps. And all of the three bedrooms are on this floor. So we've got bedroom one, two, and three to the left. To the right is the shared bathroom. So in this bathroom, it's incredibly well lit. We've got the white walls all the way around and the window, of course, for the natural sunlight. So in this bathroom, starting from the left, we get the bathtub toilet down to the right of that and then to the right of that we have the bidet. We've got the sink on this side as well as the mirror and there's some cabinet space. So in here we've got the shelf and radiator underneath. It makes for a perfect place for you to dry towels. So now moving on we'll see bedroom number one. And this is it. Absolutely spectacular. Beautiful view of the garden, out of the windows on the far wall. Down to the right, we have a chest of drawers. On the other side of the wall, we get a desk, full length mirror, and then a large standalone wardrobe. So let's get a view quickly of the garden. 
And then for the space inside of the chest of drawers, we've got six drawers just like that one. And as for the standalone, there are two rails to hang your clothes. So we've got the one here and the one all the way up top. So it's incredibly tall, so we have a lot of space for luggage down at the bottom. Moving on to bedroom number two. This room also features a double bed. We've got the same standalone wardrobe directly in front of us as we enter the room. And a quick pan around reveals we have the TV on top of the chest of drawers, radiator under the bay windows, and then a nightstand and chair in this corner. So this view is just going to be off the street and then the cul-de-sac and then the grass to the left. Also the TV doesn't have any of the channels, it's just, just thought I'd point that out. And now finally we have this final bedroom. So this room it has a single bed, standalone to the left, and the nightstand. So we get the same view outside of the window, and then there's a radiator right in between the window and the bed. As for the standalone wardrobe, it features a compartment to the right, which features some shelves, and then a rail at the top. Behind the door, there are some hooks in case you wish to hang your jacket there. And then now upstairs is also the landlord's area. It features a bedroom and then a, another bathroom and then another study space. But again, that's going to be for the landlord. We also get a skylight up above. So that's been it for this three bedrooms in the Morden area. I hope you've enjoyed it. And for more information, make sure to check out spothome.com. Bye-bye.